In this week's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to add text to your website. There's lots of different ways, but you can just add like a basic text box. If, for instance, we want to just add some text below this welcome title on our homepage inside of this container. First, I would click into whatever you want to add it to. So like if I want to add it to this container, I would just click on this container box. It's going to be helpful for when you add it, it's going to put it where you want it. Now we can go over to the plus icon to add some elements. Inside of here, the first one is actually text. And we have themed text right here. And then we have titles and paragraphs that you can choose from that are sort of, you know, some different options here with different fonts that you can choose from. So back on themed text, this is kind of like theme of your website. So it's going to pull in the font from your theme. If I wanted to, I could select one of these paragraph texts and just click on it. Now it's going to add it right in the middle of the container I had selected. And you can see that it's actually a text box. So I can click and drag on the side handles to increase or decrease the size of this text box. And then I can get in here and actually edit the text. So if we click on edit text. We have a lot of different options. Underneath our themes, we can choose again. Are we adding a heading? Are we adding paragraph text? We can kind of, um, after we've clicked on that element, change it to a different one if we would, if we don't feel like it fits very well. So if I wanted that paragraph three, I could change to that. We can change the font here. We could change the font size. We can also bold, italicize, underline, and even change the color and highlight the font or sections of our text if we want to. We can also quickly link, whether you want to link one word or multiple words or the whole text box with the whole sentence linked, you can do that too. And we can also align it. So if we wanted it to be align centered, that's the best way to do that. And then if you want to actually move the text box around, you can, and then it will lock into the center, just like every other item here in our container. So we can go back to edit text. We can scroll down here. It could be a bulleted list or a numbered list. You can increase or decrease the indents and also change the text direction. And then we have more effects and more text options. So effects like shadow, you could add a shadow to your text. You could go to character and line spacing. So you can space out the letters, that's character spacing. Line spacing is gonna be the space between the lines. This is letting if you come from a graphic design background. And you can go automatic or custom with this. You can do vertical text if you'd like. In this case, I'm not gonna do that, but you can do that without rotating. You can just enable vertical text. Then you have a little bit of SEO and accessibility, so you can choose the HTML tag here. So for instance, this would be a paragraph, because this is a paragraph text. And then you can back out of this. You could create AI text if you wanted, and I accidentally deleted our text here. Now another thing you can do with your text is actually animate it. So if you select your text box, you can go to animation, and that text can bounce in, or it can glide in. You can do some different animation options, and then you can actually customize that animation as far as the distance, the duration, the delay, and you have some other options here depending on the animation setting you select. I'm going to select none for this one. Once again, you can go quickly to the link option and link this entire piece of text. You can also double click in here and link just a single line of text like that right there, and you can choose a page. So I might go to About Us. And now it's easy is linked to about us just because I highlighted it and was able to link that. You can create AI text here too. So if we select this entire piece and hit create AI text, you can tell it your business type. What's your business name? Uh, is this a title? Is this a paragraph? And give it a few things and create the text just like that. So there's kind of like an AI text generator in here. And then of course you have your help options out here. But that is how you can add a text box and add text to your website here on Wix.